Right, right now, we have Ice Spice is losing the people. Which is facts, because, uh, like, you tuning in Ice Spice, like, who, who's listening? Because, like, you know, who, who's keeping it relevant? You feel me? Man, it's we'll crazy it how things can change so fast. When it comes to Ice Spice, she was damn near unanimously adored. From females, of course, and males as well. Whether it was because of her looks, her vibe, her music, anything like that. I've never seen Ice Spice hate come with it. <laughs> And was there some people that didn't like Ice Spice, didn't right, like her music and her movement and things of that nature? Yeah, but all that was overshadowed with the unanimous love that Ice Spice was getting damn near. So there's a viral comparison picture of Ice Spice monthly listeners before and her monthly listeners after. And it's a huge jump. I think it was at 40 million and then it dropped down to 50 million monthly listeners. That's a huge drop. People aren't rocking with her new music that she's been dropping. She dropped that Give Me a Light song, you know, that Sean Paul sample. You know, before we get into it, before he gives his opinion, I'm going to get mine. That way uh, it doesn't seem like suede or anything. But I think her music just, there was no, uh, I didn't mean to pause on this part, but, you know, I did. <laughs> but I think her music just hasn't really evolved. Like, like, the last thing I heard from her was just like, I don't know, like, she does this, like, poopy thing. Like, I don't know, it's like poopy whatever, like over and over again she's the fart the shit whatever there's like so many like different ones of that and i'm just like why is there no variation to her like her stuff it's like it's goofy whatever that's fine but there's no like substance to anything else afterwards it's just like and it's just the same thing it's like i'm not saying she, there has to be a point where she gets serious it's just there's a point where she has to change the the goofiness like it's obviously not working anymore and that's fine like i mean maybe she thought third time would be the charm and it and it as I think it was like three times she did like some kind of poopy song or something. But I think uh, once the third time fails, she's, she's about to switch it, maybe. At least I hope so, for her sake. Like, for her direction, she like switches it and finds a different, you know, meaningful flow or something. Cause, I don't and know, then she drops stuff fat this, butt it? right after, which is just like Nikki. From she the does, she flow, make catchy songs, cadence, though. just everything is just Nicki Minaj. It wasn't original. This doesn't last. And that's one dope thing about having your own flow and your own sound is because if someone copies it, people will immediately catch it and think of you because you are the originator. And I think the reason why Ice Spice's numbers have been going down and her perception has changed because she got exposed by, I think, her ex-best friend for talking down on Nicki Minaj and telling her friend how oh, she yeah, really felt about, about her. And this was a shock to many because we're thinking that Ice Spice is damn near besties with Nicki Minaj. They got a oh, few no. songs together and the songs have been doing numbers. So the last thing we was expecting was text messages like this. And when I saw this, I said, damn, if this is true, then this, I don't know, this is going to hurt Ice Spice a lot because she has she had the barbs on her side. And yeah, Ice Spice had her own fans, of course, but the barbs definitely helped her as well. It definitely elevated her. And that's cool. But when you go against Nikki and talk bad about her after she helped you, even though Ice Spice did have a buzz, I'm going to give Ice Spice credit, of course. She did have a buzz. That's why Nikki ended up working with her, you know, to add more on top of it. But Nikki helped Ice Spice a lot, you know, increasing her chart positions and all that. And when the barbs feel like you've betrayed Nicki Minaj and betrayed the whole movement, they're not going to support you. And you they will see a it. major difference, just like we're seeing now. She had 40,000 monthly listeners in her peak and now she's at 15 million. That's very concerning. But I'm also not going to give all the credit to the barbs because it could be just I Spice's music is just not hitting anymore. And maybe it could be because of playlisting, too, because when when you're put on major playlists on Spotify, like, for example, Rap Caviar, which is the biggest playlist for rap, your numbers are going to increase. It's going to shoot up. Yeah. So maybe I Spice's songs just aren't on top of the list or anything maybe it's just not a priority anymore i don't know but the barbs are definitely a contributing factor to this <laughs> those Nicki minaj fans don't play don't betray Nicki. it's it hasn't worked well for everyone that betrayed Nicki. and can ice spice make a hit without Nicki or the support of the barbs yeah but Which it's before, going right? to be harder now because now the perception of you is that you can't make this a record. This one is Ice Spice is losing good the anymore. Nikki did this for you, so it's gonna be kind of tough to 
change that perception. Basically, it's uh, looking white like ice now. spice fell off. All I'm seeing <laughs> is negative stuff about ice spice now. Because I remember before, well, I would always see right just now. good things about Ice Spice. Just good things. He just did back Whether it was her numbers going up, her being with this person, her being with that person. But now all I'm seeing is just, all I'm seeing is now is just negative stuff. It's crazy how things change. Her last song that did good was Fart, and that was the diss towards Lotto. And that one did it did good. It didn't do numbers like the other ones, but it was still a, it was still a hit, I would say. But I did like her sound and her flow on that Fisher oh, How's your night going? Got an attitude, but I'm feeling less, so I am mad at you. And I'm tired of two, and it's fat as I'm your baddest boo. I think if she explores that sound a little bit more and yeah, maybe she made more music using like that. some of that on her debut album, Y2K, I think it'll kind of help oh, because nice. it brings more of a melodic sound and a different what do you be doing on flow there? for Ice Spice. But it has to sound just good, though. Events. You can't just do something melodic and expect it to sound good it ha she has to deliver it right that's the only way for it to work nice spice is kind of limited musically but we're just gonna have to see on the y2k album what she does but damn this whole thing is crazy because she's now 0 for 2 now in terms of coming with a hit people aren't rocking with those two songs and i'm even seeing people saying yo you need to start an of <laughs> <laughs> to start an OF instead of doing music. I mean, people kind of been saying that because she's always twerking. She got a nice body. She looked good and all that. They've been it saying, makes sense. they've been telling her to make an OF, but now it's she like, make billions. they're really pressing it. Like, no, seriously, you need to make an OF because music is not working. That's what, that's what people are saying. It's just crazy how the perception and all that has changed so quickly. Like the other day, the whole world was rocking with Ice Spice. Like, what happened? <laughs> damn but do i think it's too late i'm gonna say no and I, and I know a lot of people are still rooting against her and i i get that they have their reasons but she still has a chance because she has a solid team just based off the history what the team has been doing for her the placements and all that she still has a chance but this y2k album is going to show what i spice can <laughs> really do tank, because all the eyes are going to be on her more than before it's not it's especially with pass, these like a fart. couple songs not doing well a lot of people want to see her fail so the next single or whatever she comes out with next has to be you know honestly i don't want to see her fail i, I really don't want to see her fail she's not she ain't she ain't no damn chance no you, you can't hey but i feel like that i feel like she'd have made some good music just like that uh that last song they were showing not like her fart song or whatever but just like some of her other music is actually pretty good i don't know the name of that song but i just need that one that one's that one was actually pretty good but she made she did she has potential to be great. I feel like she's just leaning towards the goofy shit too much, and she'll be all right. She definitely does have a chance. She to be more than what she's at this now. point. She has no choice. But we'll see what happens. But at the time of this recording, no people are not rocking. I believe in this spice, So. <laughs>